It's officially soup season and this cream of mushroom soup is super simple to make and will warm your soul from the inside out. Let's get started. Hey everybody, I'm Kelly with the Spurvin Soap Box and today we are making a super creamy cream of mushroom soup and it's so easy to make. You're going to use fresh button mushrooms, a little bit of half and half. You can use vegetable stock or chicken stock, onions, herbs, garlic, a little bit of cornstarch for thickener, butter, and Worcestershire sauce. This comes together in minutes and it is a great weeknight dinner. So to start, we're just gonna move over to the stove and we'll cook up some soup. First, we're going to heat the olive oil and the butter in a large heavy bottom saucepan over medium heat. Once your butter is melted and your oil is shimmering, add the onion to the pan. Just give it a little stir and cook it until softened. This is gonna take about four to five minutes. Next, stir in the mushrooms and we're gonna cook the mushrooms until they're golden and softened. That's gonna be an additional four to five minutes. The recipe calls for button mushrooms or white mushrooms, which are really common in grocery stores, but you can use a sliced porcini, you can use the baby bella mushrooms, really any type of mushroom will do really well in this soup. Sometimes I even use like a medley of mushrooms, which is just a mix of whatever mushrooms I can find at the store. Add the garlic, thyme, and bay leaf and cook for one minute. Sprinkle everything with the cornstarch and stir to coat. Just cook for another one to two minutes just to cook off the flavor of the cornstarch. Next, whisk in the chicken broth and bring it to a boil. I use chicken broth in my recipe just because it gives it a little extra depth of flavor, but if you wanna use vegetable broth or vegetable stock, mushroom stock, those are great substitutes and they taste equally amazing in this soup. Next, add the half and half and the Worcestershire sauce and just let it cook for another couple minutes until it starts to thicken. Once your soup is as thick as you like it, remove it from the heat and serve. Let's go eat some soup. So now our soup is all done and just gonna give it a taste. It's so creamy and if you want it to be even thicker, you can just add a little more cornstarch to it a splash of white wine when you're deglazing the pan is not a bad idea either. So, just ladle some into my bowl. So now I'm just gonna give it a taste, make sure it's seasoned properly, and then maybe I'll share with others. Mmm, it is so good. It's not overpowering with mushroom flavor. It's like perfectly mellow and balanced and creamy and light. It is the perfect soup. If you like this recipe, please be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. For more easy recipes, visit thesuburbansoapbox.com. Thanks again.